Alright, so I think uh, we're supposed to go talk to the mayor or maybe his secretary, the Taylor Swift lookalike. And maybe she'll give us a key. Maybe, maybe. Maybe it's Maybelline. Uh, how do I get to the mayor's office again? Good day to you mateys, it's me, Infinix Flare, and welcome back to some more Fallout 4. I am heading right into Valentine's Detective Agency just to start the new quest. New quest? Allie? The main quest. Are you here? Nick? And just nice, he's back from where were you in? It's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> You keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few. And what do we tell death? You save Nick. Not this today. Agency. Not my job. Not today, my friend. Thank you. Uh, about my case. Can we get started on my case? Oh, of course. There's just a small clerical thing. What clerical thing? No. Here. I know uh, you're not oh, on the money. table when you went out to find him, but you I mean, bottle deserve caps? a reward. Plus a little something extra, you know. Sweet, if you're looking one for fedora. Work, you don't mind putting on the detective hat? Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa, one case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Let's Maybe get so down to business. A sit down. Okay. Anyway, he came back pretty fast. No, he came back pretty slowly. We I actually did quite a couple of other stuff before. I came straight here after rescuing him and it just acted as if he arrived here. Oh well. Let's sit down and get this chit chat wave over. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. To be honest, I don't even know how long ago uh, Sean was kidnapped. It might have actually been several hundred years ago. What should I describe? I should describe uh, Sean, I guess. We're looking for my baby. A brown Sean. caterpillar. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? I think it's actually he. Infant? It's probably more than one year. On all of his care, I mean, baby he's probably wild. more than what else a year old me? now. I have a feeling it, it. The kidnapping was done several thousand years ago. Not really several thousand years. But maybe more than, I don't know, more than 10, 20 years? My husband was murdered. He was just trying to keep them from taking Sean and they... They just... They just... They just shot him. They just... It's okay. You don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers. But they waited until something went wrong. So they're actually kind-hearted killers. Now that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Agenda. Dun dun dun. A lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people: raiders, super mutants, the Gunners. What are the odds in the Institute. Institute? Especially after since so many people have been talking about institutes. It wasn't super mutants, it was a super mutant back in the vault. Raiders, that guy was too too um intelligent for a raider. Gunners maybe, but I'm gonna go with the institute. So you think this institute is responsible? Because well, it looks the like it's the, the prevalent enemy Something of goes wrong, the game. Blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model sense of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Kind of like the robots from iRobot, the androids. Infiltrate cities and pull strings that's what, I remi that's what I'm Worst reminded of, all, of. No one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype, anyway. Your prototype? I would think that you're actually a later model because you can uh, think and talk. I don't know. The, the way they they make the first gen synths sound like like they're mindless or something. You're a prototype? As far as I know, never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks yeah, and see? all metal. 
And there's the new like ones that are almost pure human. robots. I'm somewhere in between. Maybe you're like a Gen 2, Generation 2 synth. You're one of them! Uh... Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? He was bald. <laughs> bald and scarred. Uh, carried a gun. Everyone carries a gun. He had a distinctive voice? No, he's bald. One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait, it couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Did I actually hear the name Kellogg? From the flashback in the memory den? Shit, I forgot. I might have. Everything was foggy. Hmm. It's way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. Mysterious a stranger. Town, right? Oh, he's got he a... had a kid with him, didn't he? He's yeah, got that's a right. house, house in here? The house abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. He's in town. It's Sean. Is it Sean? Err. You said he lives here? He's still in town? They both vanished a while back, if I'm remembering right. But that house is still there. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Ooh boy. Alright, let's go find Kellogg. Uh, his house, actually. And, oh, hey, I got back uh, Piper because Curie was actually... She kept rambling on about her the quest to turn her into a human, so I, I don't know. She didn't really have much nice things to say. And I turned Piper into the Silver Shroud, so that's something nice, I think. Anyway, let's head on to Kellogg's place. Oh my god, it's already night time. I uh, didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Uh, Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance was bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Lady? Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies, because they're all dead. <laughs> Except you. But nine to one odds says he's our man. It's more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later. Well, I was in a chirogenic pot thing, so I couldn't really stop him. He did see me though. Maybe he didn't even consider me as an enemy, that's why I'm still alive. Yay, and I'm gonna rip his guts out. When I actually find him. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will ya? See if I can get this open. Oh, uh, here you go. Is there anyone coming? No. I think Something everyone's I sleeping. On. Why don't you give it a try? Why don't I give it a try? It's a master lock. Lock tight. I don't think I can do it. No luck. Guess we'll need to find a key. How to find a key? Hey, Valentine. Stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. The mayor's office is near the entrance of the city. There's a platform that should take you up. We're back on our way up to mayor's office. Come on, go faster, go faster. I can't wait to get into the house of my baby's kidnapper. Even if he's not inside anymore. Do I talk to you? Do you have anything for me? Receiving visitors, as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? Yes, I need a goddamn help. I want... I need to Keys talk to, to someone Kellogg's house. about Kellogg's old house in the West Stands. Mr. Kellogg's residence? He left town a while ago. We foreclosed on the property and locked it up. If there was something belonging to the man that you have a claim on, you could ask the mayor to hear you out. No guarantees. You're not gonna help me. Come on, can't you help me yourself? And if I could, why oh, should why I? Why should I? Just trust me, finding my baby. Bribe. Uh, I'm gonna. I have 
Oh, uh, I didn't equip my charisma stuff, but I'm gonna try for the hard one. Let's go. Just trust me. It's important. You have my word. Well, you do have an honest <laughs> case, and it's yes, not like there's just trust me. in an abandoned house. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this, but yeah, I can't believe you I'm actually believe. Going. Just trust me. Now, don't do anything that. Just place. trust me, to. lady. You got some trust issues. I mean, the the good kind, or is it the bad kind? Oh well, we skip talking to Mayor, which I kind of hate because he's a prick. No, not really. Uh, P Piper dislikes him, so. I'll dislike him on Hey Nick, guess who's got the keys? Oh you stopped already. You cheeky bugger, you got already know key? I was coming back with the keys. Right. Let's head in. You do the honors. So what are we gonna find inside? Hopefully not him waiting for us. Well he's supposedly to have been gone for quite a while, so Let's take a look around. So let's Got cross our fingers. Let's steal his shit. Oh, we can actually steal his shit because he's not around anymore. <laughs> I'll just steal his duct tape. Figured a guy like Kellogg would think big. Would think big, huh? Uh, let's see. Oh, secret button. I'll press that later. I'm gonna go upstairs and see. Uh, nothing here. Did you check out that desk? Yeah, I already see the secret button. But give me a moment. We can't see anything in his dresser. So, all right, let's go press you, the not shiny right. big red. Look for anything out of sorts. A switch. You don't have to be so heavy-handed with your clues. Well, that's one way to hide a room. Oh, okay, it's over there. Aha! It's Slightly bigger. Uh, look at this. All of a Merc's favorite things. All right, let's actually steal his ammo because I don't think he needs it anymore. Nick. Well, look at that. All of Kellogg's favorite. Oh, duffel bag with nice shit. What's a large beaker doing inside it? I don't really care. Uh, food. I'm really just taking all his his ammo and his drugs. San Francisco. Uh, mm, is he actually pointing to his cigar thing? Oh, he. Did you just take it? I'm confused. Okay, that's. Gwyneth Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. Anyone that can actually tell us about the the cigarettes? Ah, uh, what else is there to see? I feel like I'm missing something really important. Oh, uh, suggestions. Use dog meat. I don't have dog meat with me right you. here. Hmm. Any suggestions, Nick? Hmm. What about dog meat? Commonwealth mutt like him can track a man's scent for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. Can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. No, I have uh, Piper with me. I don't know if I should actually take Nick along because he might have some dialogue for this quest, but Piper might have too. What's Any your advice? Words of wisdom? If Kellogg really is the one who kidnapped your son, then he's dangerous. But so are you. <laughs> you don't need to be afraid of him. Thanks for Anything the vote of confidence. Throws at you. Um, oh crap, I really don't know. Maybe I should get him to come along. Yeah, come with me, Nick. I want you with me on this, Nick. Uh oh, uh, great, cut off his speech, won't you? I'll send Piper back to Sanctuary Hills for now. Alright, let's get that bastard. This is your show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. 
Okay, if you say so. Uh, oh, there wasn't any nice dialogue for Piper to say as I send her back. That's kind of disappointing, but we need to go back to Sanctuary Hills if I'm not wrong, right? What are we supposed to do? Show Dog Meat a cigar and he's back at Sanctuary, so... Uh, why are you sitting down? Let's go. Oh, what the frick frag? Dog meat, what are you doing here? That's kind of uh, crazy. Well, since you're here, dog meat, get the scent boy. Did you get the scent Got boy? boy? All right. What what does that mean? Okay, he's got the scent, so I guess we're supposed to find him, and we've completed the quest of getting a clue. But I am gonna end the episode here, even though we're- okay, we're starting a new one. Right, right, we're starting a new one. I'm gonna end this episode here. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please do leave a like. It really helps, and it really means a lot to me. So, as always, I'll see you guys in the next one, and this is Infi signing out. Okay, so. No, 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 I got to it. Oh my god. Yeah, headshot for days. <laughs>